Sim Chow from Mune. Mooney? Mooney. From Mooney. We are at Nemo Beach. We're going to take a walk down this little thing. Do my little 4K walking. This is on the Go camera. So I did like the way the video performed on the Sony phone. Let's try it on the Go. Not too much going on Mooney either. I was just at the most popular bar in Mooney. One of the highest rated. There was me and two other people. So it's just, you know, it's pre-Tet, so there's just not gonna be a lot going on pre-Tet. Makes sense. All you're gonna really see here is tourists. So you're not gonna see much Vietnamese because they're not gonna travel till Tet. Most of the people I saw in Move and Pick and Fan Thiet were like Korean Chinese from different countries. So let me show you a little bit what it's like walk with this thing. Let's see how its stabilization looks. This is pretty rustic. There's like some really nice houses, like what would be a really nice beast house and then all this. It's not that bad. I, I wouldn't be stoked to have this in front of my house. I'm sure they fish for stuff at night too. You fish, I'm sure some things you fish for at night, some during the day. Well, you can drive down here. There's other expats down here, so. Yeah. Weather's very nice right now. I don't mind this weather at all. You can't, you can't beat it. I like places not incredibly busy, so you know this is why I travel on the pre tet Things are been pretty busy though with other tourists and stuff. It's like another expat bar up here. Not that windy, thankfully, so we don't have to worry about wind on the mic. Yeah, this camera did really well so far. My thoughts on Mooney are a lot of my thoughts on Fantiet, to be honest with you. It's very nice, it's very chill, it's very laid back. Don't expect a lot. This place is for chilling, chilling with the loved ones, chilling as a solo traveler, just like chilling. Oh, there's a bunch of expats up here, so. A couple of hotties up here, actually. So La Vila, this place was on the place to come drink to. A couple of old expats. These guys are fun to drink with sometimes, so. So many people here, but let's see what we got here with the girls. Maybe one's got a nice set of juggalos. Milkers. Pardon my French, but we got some milkers. It's uncomfortable, yeah. I thought I packed a selfie stick, I forgot it. But it's okay, we're only doing like 10 minutes. That's why I keep switching hands. <laughs> That's why I keep set, drop down center focus and walk with the FPV too. Not a whole lot down here. We might keep this pretty short. Well, people do swim here. You know, my time in Mooney is going to be limited, but from what I see, it's nice. I'm going to get on the motorbike and drive around more. We'll walk back on the ocean side, but, you know, it's cool. It's nothing crazy. Uh, is that a bad thing? No. Oh, enjoy it for, like, what it is, you know. Old Mooney. Mooney.
so they, they go and fish in these little boats. I don't know why they use these little boats. Maybe they're good for some reason. There's probably like an actual reason. Oh, we got a resident DJ. So this must be like where white guys live from. So there must be like a little expat community like you can tell. If there was like a younger Mark, I could see him bringing out some DJ equipment and playing some sick beats. Sick, sick beats. Food today. Fresh oyster grill, seafood barbecue set, chicken curry vegan, grilled fish. Look at that, Tiger 30K. So La Vila, cheap. La Vila is a good place to go. My hotel, you can't eat or drink there. You can, but it's stupid. They want like 90K for a Tiger. Which I don't get it, your amenities are already expensive, but I guess you're trying to match your amenity output. Save everything and everyone. Another dog. So yeah, Muni, Muni, Muni. It's cool. I couldn't see like potentially living here. It's way laid back, but it's definitely got some cool resource vibes. It's going to be just like you know, essentially the thing at. And yet, you're not gonna have, there's more stuff of course here to do around here. So there's definitely more access to stuff here. That is a for sure, but it's, it's just slow, slow down. Things are gonna close at 10 or 11. And Mune, you're gonna find a few places like this Nemo's, that place that La Vila is open till midnight. I think there's a couple places open till one. And then there's like a couple clubs between here and Fantiette that are open till like two or 3 a.m. So you can st definitely party here. So I mean... This is good. Just don't expect a whole ton. So yeah, again, my thing would be stay at the resort here, have fun at your resort, explore a little, be comfortable, bring somebody you love with you, have fun that's gonna be it that's a wrap on this one thank you for watching if you want to support me over on patreon we do have that there's gonna be the first episode for this series on there and additional bonus content as well on the patreon and there, as well as 150 plus videos as of now so there's a lot of stuff on there if you want to watch me live stream that's at zbats.com forward slash kick.com forward slash zbats so thanks for watching see you on the next one stay frosty peace out